The Lord be with you. I'm Deacon Keith Fournier. And our first reading is taken from the book of the prophet Isaiah. Thus says Yahweh, Make fair judgment your concern. Act with justice, for soon my salvation will come, and my saving justice will be manifest. Blessed is anyone who does this, anyone who clings to it, observing the Sabbath, not profaning it, and abstaining from every evil deed. No foreigner adhering to Yahweh should say, Yahweh will utterly exclude me from his people. No eunuch should say, look, I'm a dried up tree. As for foreigners who adhere to Yahweh to serve him, to love Yahweh's name and become his servants, all who observe the Sabbath, not profaning it, and cling to my covenant, these I shall lead to my holy mountain and make them joyful in my house of prayer. Their burnt offerings and sacrifices will be accepted on my altar. For my house will be called a house of prayer for all peoples. Lord Yahweh, who gathers the exiles of Israel, declares, There are others I shall gather besides those already gathered. In our responsorial psalm is from Psalm 67. Then the earth will acknowledge your ways, and all nations your power to save. Let the nations praise you, God. Let all the nations praise you. Let the nations praise you, God. Let all the nations praise you. May God continue to bless us and be revered by the whole wide world. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. John. And Jesus said, You sent messengers to John, and he gave his testimony to the truth. Not that I depend on human testimony, no. It is for your salvation that I mention it. John was a lamp lit and shining, and for a time you were content to enjoy the light he gave. But my testimony is greater than John's. The deeds my Father has given me to perform these same deeds of mine testify that the Father has sent me. The Gospel of the Lord.